Hello everyone, Glenn here, and welcome back to another day with Let's Vlog with Glenn Magro. And I'm not sure if I said this, but I'm now 25 years old. I turned 25 last week. That was good. But basically, I feel like the same person I was 24 years old. And in sad news, that poor Chadwick Boseman, who died from colon cancer yesterday, well, two days ago, my heart goes out for his friends and family. It's so devastating. Like, I didn't know that Chadwick Boseman had colon cancer for the last four years when he was making um, Captain America Civil War, Black Panther, and um, the Avengers, Ed Game, End Game, and Infinity War, and other movies during his chemotherapy and cancer treatment. Very sad. I just didn't realize that. I just didn't even know about it until recently when he passed away from it. Like, oh, damn, King T'Challa. The Black Panther. That was one of the greatest movies I ever watched. Greatest superhero movies I ever watched. Man. It's amazing, God. So gut wrenching. Just think about it. who's gonna take over his place in Marvel. Who's gonna be King in Black Panther two when it comes out in a few years? God. First, Stanley. Now. Chadwick Boseman. So gut wrenching. It makes you think that how life is short. Forty three years old, Chadwick Boseman died at forty three years of age. Life is so short. Same thing goes with Kobe Bryant. A little bit while back. When he died. Along the side with his daughter. In a helicopter crash in Calabasas, California. It's so tragic. I mean, like, It's times like these that you need to think about life. Think about what you're doing. And just go for it. You only get one chance at life. Don't fuck it up. God. It's so devastating. Forty three. It's still too young. It's still too young to die from cancer. It's still too young. Oh, damn it. I hate crying. 
hate being sad. But this is what life is. It's inevitable for us to die. But we have to go on and live our lives to the fullest. So sad. Rest in peace, Chadwick Boseman. So devastating.